Miss Frost, this is fantastic. This makes the game real. It's not a fantasy anymore. I knew you were ready by the way you played the game. But this is just the beginning. There's so much more. Last night I cast my first spell. This is real power. Which spell did you cast, Debbie? I used the mind bondage spell on my professor. He was trying to stop me from playing RPGs. What was the result? He gave me an A plus for a history paper in which I wrote about Maven of the Eventide. It was great. Do... Do you think Mistress Frost will ever teach me the real power and let me join the coven? Oh, yes. In fact, if you reach level 8 by next week, you'll be able to join us for the Skyclad ceremony. I would love to be with you in that. I think your hands are perfect for spell casting. So delicate and small. There's so much that you could do with them. I've got to reach level eight right away. <laughs> Hello, Mistress Frost. Enough chit-chatting. We have important matters to discuss. The evil undead Lich Zykon is attempting to reach the gate. Um, Mistress Frost? Yes, Marcy? Um, since Debbie is eighth level and I'm still level seven, we were wondering if we could do anything harder. I still love the game, but it doesn't have the same kick it used to have, you know? I could go for some stronger stuff. And Marcy needs to be able to keep up with me. Very well. Then it is time for L-A-R-P. What's that? Live action role playing! Though you have gained many skills through your RPGing, LARPing will tax them as they've never been taxed before. Who are you? Uh. I'm Marcy. No, you are not Marcy. Who are you? I'm Blackleaf, the thief of the shadows. And you? I am Elfstar, cleric and possessor of the real power. And I am Dungeon's mistress, your guide in the world of dark dungeons. You must trust me without hesitation, for this is the most important adventure of your very lives. You have one goal, and one goal only, to stay in the game. What do you mean? I mean that this is LARPing. This is an experience like no other. And if you break character, that most sacred of RPG covenants, I will banish you from all tables until the end of time. You will lose all that you have gained, and you will no longer be welcome in any of my circles. You face real risk tonight, for that is what it means to LARP. You come across this in your quest. It appears to be some kind of Arabic. Wait, Marcy, didn't you learn Arabic? You needed it to convert the Muslims, who didn't realize they were actually worshipping the moon god. I'm not sure I should. Marcy, we need to get you to level 8. Tonight. Read it. La mei san mei... Anastol tiro alentithor Abdewal bi marul al hokeb hatel miach kajufna. I think it means something is not dead, which has the capacity to exist eternally. And if the abnormal duration comes, then death might cease. What on earth does that mean? That is not dead, which can eternal lie. And with strange eons, even death may die. Mistress Frost, the Dark One requires a sacrifice if he is to fully rise. I can easily take care of that. 
No. The Dark One needs one of them to take her own life. You encounter two separate cave entrances. I think we should split up to cover more ground. Elfstar, you travel deep, deep down your path, where you encounter the zombie. I shall decapitate the fiend. And Blackleaf, you encounter... This, my true form. How are you doing that with your voice? <laughs> oh, I am not your friend. I am not who you thought you knew. I am the darkness you have led into your life. I am Legion. Stop that right now! You cannot help her, Elstar. You are fighting the zombie. If you act, you will be breaking character. Get off me! Get off me! I don't want this! Stop it! And I will show you what it is to know fear. Demi! Make him stop! Wait for it. Elstar possesses the real power. Debbie does not. If you cease to be Elstar, all of your powers will disappear. Good. I now declare that Elfstar has defeated the zombie and may now act. Sleep! Kudagra! 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 Well played. You have defeated Tiamat and only need to exit the dungeon to earn your reward. <laughs> oh, oh, man. It's all right. You'll be okay. Just get me out of here, Debbie. Just take me home. The thief, Blackleaf, did not find the poison trap, and I declare her dead. She must leave the game and walk home as alone on her path as she is in her grave. No. No, Blackleaf. No. No. I'm going to die. Don't make me quit the game. Please don't. You must choose if you will stay in the game or be banished. Marcy, get out of here. You're dead. You don't exist anymore. But, but... Blackleaf has been killed. I can't talk to someone who's dead, not without leaving character. I can't. So just walk away. If I'm Blackleaf, and if Blackleaf is dead, then... Well done, my precious. <laughs>